Hello everybody, this is Sweet Sweet Readings and today this reading is going to be for Pisces for the month of February. February, we will see what will bring it for you, Pisces. Guys, please make sure that you check your signs for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus before proceeding. This is for Pisces. For the month of February, please show me clear messages for Pisces for the month of February, please. Let's see, what do we have for Pisces? Hmm, Pisces, are you... I will have to clarify before I make a decision about it. Very beautiful cards, Pisces. Um, okay, the lover wants to pop as well. So, Pisces, what do we have for you? We have the Queen of Cups, the Six of Cups, the Ten of Cups, and the Lovers. So, there are a lot of cups, which means the emotional um, bond that you feel towards somebody is very strong. And the emotional bond that somebody feels towards you is very strong. Okay. Now, I see you being a little bit moody, and this is weird. This is weird because I am sensing that you are kind of like worrying about something that has not happened yet. Okay, you are worrying about something that has not happened yet. You know, when you're worrying about something that it is not going my way, I don't like it. Why is this person not doing A, B, C, and D? You know? Something like that. You're be I see you being very moody about things with the Six of Cups and that. Okay. I see that in the past you did have a, a talk with this person. Whoever you're deeply emotionally connected to, you had a talk with them. And that talk did not last that long. Okay, the conversation was not so long. It was short and sweet and simple. It wasn't mean, but... It wasn't a long conversation when, when, uh, where you both are telling each other how you feel about each other. However, in the past, uh, in the future, I see the Ten of Cups for you, Pisces, which is amazing. Um, I see that your life in terms of um, finances is going to be very, very improved. Now, this to me is also showing me wish fulfillment of some sort. Um, there's something at the bottom of the deck, which is the Eight of Wands for you, Pisces. This is amazing. Somebody wants to talk to you. Okay. I really want to pull the card at, at the top of the deck. It's been quite some time now and I'm resisting the urge to pull this card. I will pull it, but before that, I will tell you guys what I see. So Pisces, for you, I see that, let me put it here. For you, I see that you are very much in your emotions these days, okay? But the thing is that in terms of your job, your studies or things like that, you have been working hard and your hard work is going to bring you rewards, okay? Your hard work will bring you the reward that you're looking for. With the Ten of Cups, I also see situation improving with this person for you. Um, you know, things improving. This person reaching out to you and then you both are happy again. In the past, I, uh, I do see that you two, this Ten of Cups was there in the past, okay? Um, maybe like two months ago. Or something like that okay you two were together like this you two were happy you two were very much in love and expressing love but then of course something came up that communication dropped but what are you upset about Pisces I want to know that you're upset about something you know becoming moody and isolating yourself almost okay um, even though these cards are beautiful, but there is something that is telling me that you're moody these days, okay? 
and you want something to go a certain way and it is not however i see your person talking to you i see them reaching out to you because they have a lot of emotion for you just like you do for them i did say that before as well pisces we have communication coming your way okay um this is the page of wands this is the two of wands and then we have the eight of wands there's um you could be dealing with a fire sign aries leo sagittarius who wants to talk to you who wants to communicate but right now this person is taking a lot of time okay and maybe that is why you're becoming moody about it because you want to hear from them and they're taking their time okay but you know what after taking all the time in the world they will reach out to you they will talk to you i feel like they want to explore something with you like it's gonna be very fresh and new even though you might know this person it's gonna be very fresh their energy they're coming towards you with a very fresh energy um you know and they want this partnership they're thinking about this partnership with you there's a lot of passion that is building up here okay you two are a little bit distant from each other right now but there's passion building and i like it <laughs> okay because this person will reach out to you other than that pisces i see things going in a very positive direction for you um you know maybe there are things changing in your life um things are changing in your life you know you're headed towards prosperity and something is changing in your life something in your life is very different from what it was okay and i do see that i do see your finances improving majorly as well okay life and universe is bringing you better things in general okay and this person is taking their time to talk to you, but they will talk to you, okay? They will talk to you. Alright, let's see. What do we have here? This is the card that I've been wanting to pull since, like, the beginning of the video. Which is the... Oops, okay. The Four of, Wand, uh, four of Swords. So, with the Four of Swords, I see that there was a break in the relationship. Like I said before, communication dropped between the two of you. You two stop talking to each other. Now, th maybe the communication dropped from your person's side, not your side. And this person is still taking, you know, some time. And I feel like they're thinking a lot about you. They feel like um, they should take their time before reaching out to you. And whenever they reach out to you, it's going to be very passionate. I'm telling you right now um they're taking a break now this could be you as well okay for you this is signifying something else for me okay for you i think that you want to almost like give up on something because you're so tired of being moody about it that you want to give up on it now for some of you i see you um taking a lot of rest or focusing on resting um, in terms of, you know, not tiring yourself too much, being more self-focused and, you know, really focusing on what serves you, what doesn't. Life is really bringing you amazing um, things, Pisces, if you're open to it. Pisces, uh, if I tell you that you are being like this, it's not going to be false that you are wondering about this person okay now i see you being you see how this person is like surrounded by pentacles surrounded by stability good things but all he's wondering about is something else okay and i do see you being like this okay you're wondering about this connection even though things are going amazing in your life. I feel like you're losing your patience for some of you. You could be overstressing yourself over this. You want things to happen fast and they're not. And you're like a little bit hopeless about it and sad about it. Like It's almost like pissing you off now. But the reason why this person is moving slow is because they're taking their time before they talk to you. So try to give it some time. 
try to have some patience okay Pisces because they will reach out to you I clearly see that okay even if they don't reach out to you there is a lot of things that universe is bringing for you you see the ten of cups this is for you okay a lot of fulfillment a lot of happy times ahead so this person is not making any moves right now and that is kind of pissing you off which is fine okay um but for i think that you should focus on what's in front of you rather than what's not happening okay now pisces do you see that at the bottom of the deck we have the knight of wands so this person whoever you're dealing with now their personality is coming into the show they feel like things um became stagnant between the two of you and they kind of want to change it too okay now this could be somebody you're dealing with that they have their finances together they're very hard working they're self-focused and whoever this person you're dealing with is i just see that they're you know they're very like they have a strong um thing for what they want and they want it at all cost okay now this person seems to be guarded in terms of their emotions maybe they don't express a lot okay put it put it there so pisces we have the knight of pentacles the higher front and the nine of pentacles so there are a lot of pentacles here that i see for you pisces um they're taking a lot of time to come towards you and talk to you do you see that for some of you this person thinks that you they're seeing you in a very different light these days pisces they're not seeing you how they saw you before who they can be with for the rest of their life you know they could be viewing you as their you know long-term partner however i see that this person whoever you're dealing with is very you know they have things going on in their life they're dealing with a lot of things in their life but they wonder about you they think about you okay the difference is just that they're taking a lot of a lot of time to make a move towards you however after taking all of the time in the world they will come come and talk to you okay they seem to be very guarded you know maybe this person has a hard time expressing their emotions properly because they're processing how they feel towards you as well okay pisces all right do you understand that you don't have to be impatient okay try to give it some time try to enjoy what your life is bringing you because i know life is bringing you amazing things right now try to enjoy that okay and let this person move at their pace okay you're trying to rush into things in the in the past you did talk to them and it wasn't very long okay the conversation wasn't long um yeah that is that let's see for more what do we have for pisces what do we have for pisces furthermore what do we have for pisces what do we have for pisces the knight of wands really wants to show up here so we have the hermit so pisces i feel like you are um really taking your time too and i feel like these days your intuition is bomb okay but you all you have to do is trust it and you you are trying to even you know let it go slowly but it's not gonna be you know all of a sudden you're trying to let go okay pisces for you we have the three of cups and the three of wands wow for you i see somebody coming towards you and i see you okay pisces i'm sensing this that there might have been something that you have always wanted and now is the time that you achieved it maybe you achieved a goal maybe you got something that you wanted or there's just something good that came to you okay and 
in terms of like the whole month of February, I see a lot of good things coming your way, which is amazing. You know, good energy, um, good vibes, good finances, um, positive energies. Um, this person who you're who you're dealing with is looking back, uh, and they wonder what you're up to. Okay, they do, they do, and they want to come back. I feel like they will gear up and talk to you. They will. Do you see that? Do you see that? Just before I said that. Okay, I just I just told you that they want to talk to you, and they will talk to you. You're running out of patience here, but. You got to keep some of it because this person is coming towards you to talk to you. Now, this could be somebody who will talk to you when you least expect it and rush in too soon, talk to you and be surprise you, okay? The communication that comes from their side is going to surprise you. Let's not talk about this person because I already told you that they're going to come towards you and offer you love, offer you emotions, okay? Um, yeah. At the at the bottom of the deck, we have the Page of Pentacles. Who are you kidding? Um, they are coming towards you. They want to offer you something. All right, we are done with this person. I'm already done talking about them. Let's talk about you, okay? For you, I feel like Pisces, this month is going to bring you a lot of good things. Like I said before many, many times. Um, with the Three of Cups and the Three of Wands, you could be, you know, partying a little bit, you know, having a good time with your friends and something like that. Um, you know, yeah, just hanging out with your friends, having a good time. And I feel like you have gotten something that you have always wanted and you're looking back on how much things have changed in your life. I do see that. I see that your life has turned around a little bit and you are looking back and seeing how far you've come or how much things have changed for you in your life in other aspects other than this person, okay? Like in terms of your finances, your job, your career, something in your life has changed and you are realizing that as well. Now, the best thing for you to do is to move with it because universe is moving you towards a different direction and if you do move with it and enjoy things that come your way this person is is also eventually coming towards you okay so you might as well enjoy the process because i see um good things coming your way and new things you know you could be having new beginnings um you could be making new friends, you could be getting a new job, or you, you will be getting something that you always wanted, and you're going to be very, very happy about it, okay? All right, Pisces, so that was your reading for February. I really enjoyed reading for you today. It was amazing. I'm a Pisces myself, so thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if it did resonate with you. If you would like a private reading, you can check out the description box. All the details are there. I am currently doing it for only limited amount of time. So yeah, that's all. Thank you so much for watching and I shall see you guys later.